Good morning, Newcastle, and a very pleasant welcome. As uh, we got off to uh, what was a snowy start this morning, and um, then uh, got a little rain, and now you've got streets that are just wet. Uh, so, um, we're going to uh, get and uh, update you with everything going on in what I call the greatest castle in the world. And uh, kind of get everything squared away as um, I bring you the top stories of this uh, Sunday. And uh, I always make sure it's better for me to take a few extra seconds okay and uh, kind of just make sure that everything is uh, all right because sometimes there's buttons not pressed or or what have you and um, it becomes very um, annoying <laughs> for lack of a better word to the viewer who um, probably can't understand why it sounds like they're at uh, one of the stadiums or uh, somewhere else uh, so uh, I do that so that um, everything works out and it does so uh, as we get to uh, what's going on today in Newcastle PA let me get all squared away and tell you that the train is on the tracks and Sunday News Watch the weekend edition is straight ahead for you if you think there's nothing to do in Newcastle and Lawrence County, then think again. Always stay connected to NCTV 45 to receive the information on events going on in and around the area on a daily basis. Programs to view are Newswatch, The Morning Show, and Community Happenings. NCTV 45 takes pride in bringing you the event and organization info that you want. NCTV 45 is the number one media source locally. NCTV 45, anytime on your time. Entrusting your loved one to a funeral director is a very personal and emotional decision. The funeral director you choose must understand the importance of the decision you have made. When you call the William and Roger DiCarbo Funeral Home, I recognize what a privilege it is to be chosen at your time of need. We will provide you and your family with the best service possible, with sincerity and compassion. The William and Roger DiCarbo Funeral Home, family owned and operated since 1941. Come dine with us, come dine, come dine today. If you could use some real good food, there's a place not far away. If you could use a drink or two, or a place to go and play, come to Gallows Italian Villa today. Simple elegance in a majestic setting. Yes, right here in downtown Newcastle. Minutes away from shopping. Seconds from a gas station. And let's not forget pastries, a restaurant, and oh yes, the schools. The majestic for that majestic lifestyle right in the greatest castle new castle come by and take a look
Chuck Tanner would be proud of the restaurant that bears his name. Chuck Tanner's Restaurant, owned and operated by the Papazikas family, would love for you to be part of a Newcastle tradition. Come enjoy the great breakfast, super lunch, and second-to-none dinner choices from their Italian, Mediterranean, and American cuisine. You can relax with a wonderful atmosphere and something from the bar. If you're planning an event, ask about their banquet facility. Tanner's Restaurant is located at 2305 Wilmington Road in New Shannock Township. Call 724-658-5900. Well, we're back, and um, we have a lot of things to uh, say, do, talk about, and uh, so let's uh, kind of get to them. First of all, uh, the weather. We have um, got and picked up a few degrees as... Uh, it was 32 and we were getting snow and now we're at 33 but um, at least it's overcast the roads have gotten better uh, for people that couldn't make it out to Sunday Mass you can get it right here on NCTV 45 as we bring you Sunday Mass from Holy Spirit Parish and it's okay if you're another denomination make sure that you tune in Cleveland radar um, and uh, why not give it a look-see uh, and just to give you an idea clear from Cleveland all the way to the castle and uh, we'll put that right up here because um, any of you out traveling maybe you're getting around for the Super Bowl uh, if you're going to Pittsburgh okay there's the big blotch that passed us okay and it's uh, it's pretty much on its way out so uh, as the winds were from the southwest and just pushed that thing up into Clarion and off to our northeast that being said a um, few other things that uh, we'll get to today in uh, giving you kind of a heads up on what's going on now you know this has been in uh, the Holy Spirit Parish Bulletin and everybody is welcome Big Easy Parish Center, corner of North and Beaver, St. Mary's, okay, site. Monday, uh, well, back in December, they brought tickets on sale. Tickets are $40, <coughs> 35 for if you get an early bird discount. No tickets will be sold at the door. They're going to have a Mardi Gras, and this Eric DeFay will be performing. He's been on Soundstage and all those things on PBS. He's, he's played with Josh Gorbin, Rosemary Clooney, and um, Dave Lieberman. And uh, just a real good night, evening with food and what have you. Make sure that you check it out and uh, enjoy Mardi Gras and that's coming up uh, because uh, wow I can't believe the date and the time February 22nd Saturday and we're in February already so you're looking at one two three four weeks and it's there uh, so that going on now, um, January was National Mentor Month. Uh, make sure you know that February 8th, there's a mentoring thing at Epworth uh, United Press or Epworth Church up there on uh, 
uh, and it's not Presbyterian, excuse me, it's Methodist. Uh, so check that out. February 2nd, today, family fun, kids two to four. They'll make Valentine boxes and uh, parent cl classes, how to get items for your children. Slippery Rock Area Parks and Recreation, having this. Sponsored by the Alpha and Omega Center, 724-794-3325. Um, February 2nd, they're doing a Groundhog's Day hike, 1 to 3 p.m. Now, severe weather, I think that's bias. So the hike was is still on. Wear sturdy shoes uh, and dress for dress for winter. You're not going to go summer swimming here. 225 Pleasant Valley Road, Portersville, and uh, you can take a hike. That's one to three. So um, you're watching us now, you better get ready to get out there now. Um, Everybody knows big game today. Uh, let's go through some scores. The Celtics beat the 76ers 116 to 95. The Wizards beat the Nets 113-107. The Spurs. Well, Angelo, they crushed the Hornets 114 to 90. So uh, Dan and you both got wins. College basketball. Here you go. Creighton beats Villanova. Kansas beats Texas Tech by 3, 78-75. Boston College wins by 1 over North Carolina, 71-70. Baylor takes out TCU, 68-52. Auburn beats Kentucky, 75-76. San Diego over Utah State, 80-68. And um, also, and I wanted to give you this kind of update, and um, Notre Dame, 80, Georgia Tech, 72. Uh, and YSU won nine over Indiana University, Purdue University. 91.76. So, way to go, Irish. Today, 2 p.m., Duquesne, 15 and 5, takes on 10 and 10, LaSalle. As the Dukes try and get back on a winning streak. Let's, um, let's head on over to the Cedar Sports Corner and, uh, Check out what's on tap today. We'll be right back. The Cedars Restaurant in Newcastle wants you to indulge in the food from their pleasing menu. The Cedars features Mediterranean, pub food, Middle Eastern cuisine, and so much more. They're open every day, 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. Call the Cedars on the east side at 827 Addis Street, Newcastle. 724-658-9543. That's 724-658-9543. Hello and welcome to the Cedar Sports Corner Report. Let's get to college basketball. Well, as uh, we uh, get ready for uh, the big football game this afternoon, what you have is LaSalle visiting the Duquesne Dukes. That's a two. The University of Miami Hurricane will be at the Pitt Panthers. That's at noon. Elsewhere, Iona at Manhattan, Illinois at Iowa. You have Georgetown at St. John's, uh, and uh, Utah 
at UCLA. That's a 3 o'clock start. 4 o'clock start, Siena at St. Peter's. Now, uh, that'll get you through uh, the men's college basketball schedule. And uh, as you gander over at hockey, and um, same as uh, basketball, the schedule kind of like the Pittsburgh Penguins, 12.30 start against the Washington Capitals. The Columbus Blue Jackets will have a 2 o'clock start against Montreal. And Vancouver will take on the Carolina Hurricane at 2 o'clock. NBC will carry the Pens game, just to let you know. And over in the NBA, as um, they get their Sunday matchups in, Denver will be at Detroit, 12.30. New Orleans will be at Houston, 2 o'clock. Phoenix will be at the Milwaukee Bucks. That's a 2 o'clock start. And Chicago will be at Toronto. That's a 3 o'clock start. And that was the Cedars Sports Corner. Head on over to Cedars. Get some great food, cold beverage, and enjoy those games. And don't forget, uh, just a little reminder, the football game, I think you know San Francisco and Kansas City. So uh, didn't want to leave that out. And uh, I think I don't know who you're for. Go to Cedars, get some great food. We'll take a timeout. We'll be right back. This program furnished by Sporting Goods, 23 East Washington Street, Newcastle. Call 724-658-2535. Penn, Ohio Bottled Water Company, home residential, commercial, water coolers. You can contact us Monday through Friday, 8 to 5 p.m. We're fast, efficient, and we deliver water. We offer 100% customer satisfaction guarantee. Contact us today at 724-498-4760. This program brought to you by Cummings Landscaping and Design. Random Cummings, lower operator. Hello, and we're back, and uh, let's give you a little look-see at this Cleveland radar. Clear, as uh, you can see from Cleveland to Newcastle, and uh, here you go over to uh, Pittsburgh radar, all the storms and snow and what have you. Well to our northeast they're just in front of us when uh, city trucks uh, the roads are clear now um, all safe uh, so uh, you'll, you should have no problem getting around and uh, news watch rolls on Febu <coughs> February 10th through June 15th, emergency medical technician classes 
Mondays and Wednesdays, 6 to 10 p.m., Lawrence County Career and Technical Center, Phillips Street, Newcastle. More information, 724-65. Check that, 724-202-7105. February 14th and 15th, it's a marriage retreat. $40 per couple. you got to make a reservation, 724-652-6439. 6439 Wayside Emanuel Church in the Shannock. And um, I was telling you about Epworth Church as they uh, do their men mentoring program. That's Saturday, February 8th at 4 p.m. Just to um, kind of give you updates on what's going on, where, what, and where, when, how, why, what, all that. Struggling with addiction? Well, uh, Pathways to Freedom, Vision Ministries, 109 North Mercer Street, right out our side door here. And um, make sure if you want to go to a meeting there. Uh, tell Randy Crumb, NCTV 45 sent you. And remember, every person, you're worth it. You can beat it. Now, uh, Big Game Underground Refuge, First Church of Christ, 12 West Euclid, Newcastle, call 724-658-3951. And uh, Fusion, enjoy the Super Bowl Big Game with family and friends. Next Fusion, February 9th, 6 p.m. to 8 that's at the Sankey Center. Remember, luxurious apartments await you at the Majestic. Come and see what we're talking about. They start at 575. Would love to have you as a neighbor down here. And you with NCTV 45 and great activities. Everything absolutely spectacular. Come and visit. You'll really be impressed. Now, um, with all that said, it is time to get to weather. Well, I, I do this to get this out of the way. You can see how everything's cleared up. Not, right here under the G in Youngstown, that's Newcastle. Just So, Newcastle to Cleveland, clear. Newcastle to Pittsburgh clear. Matter of fact, it's clear from Cleveland all the way down to Pittsburgh. And uh, what do we have for your forecast? 33 degrees, 89 percent humidity, winds are variable at 6 miles an hour, 29.54 is the barometric pressure, the dew point 30 Visibility 10 and wind chill 27. Now, um, let's take a look at Lawrence County 45 weather and we'll be right back. BSP. Big shot bobs are the wings for me. 50 flavors make it right you see. BSB has sandwiches you have to try. Stop in and you'll know why. Every day of the week you see. Call or stop in to BSB. Big Shot Bob's will be your favorite place. Just like me. BSB. Big Shot Bob. Easy clean car and van wash where 
where you are clean wash is our goal. Castle and a very snowy morning to you as uh, we get lined up here for Lawrence County 45 weather and uh, I'll tell you it was like well I was having my coffee and uh, then all of a sudden it started to snow and as I learned uh, it was picking up and um, picking up and picking up to a great extent so let, let's um, first take a look at the weather outside and um, this um, kind of gives you an idea of what it's like First of all, in the Shannick Township on Wilmington Road, okay, and I want to uh, be able to um, kind of give you a shot here as to, th this is coming down Route 18, and uh, not what you would want to see as um, that that wintertime uh, weather and uh, we haven't had this for a while so while there is no massive accumulation the the roads are slick um, I don't think anybody thought we were going to have this type of uh, outside type weather and um, Thanks, uh, Ronald Keys, for and Michelle Flieger for your comment. Um, so that's Route 18 as you uh, get to Clanmore. Now, what do you have beyond that? Well, I took the uh, the advantage to show you as you got a little bit further in the town what you had and um, here was it as you cross the state line <laughs> I keep saying state line but uh, down by the hospital uh, this type of look nothing's really changed um, and this is coming down Jefferson Street Hill. Uh, it's, I can tell you the hill is very slick. I can tell you Highland and Mercer aren't any better. And I can only imagine over by the courthouse, you're not getting a real, real great area shot um, right now with respect to uh, how it looks there so um, that's coming down the hill by Pizza Hut and um, right outside it gave us the ability to uh, take a look at uh, this area here uh, that is Fall Street and it shows the other two hills uh, that would exist um, so uh, this being there off of the distance you can see the Anglican Church and Highland Avenue the Highland Mercer Street area Snow covered on Fall Street and then behind it, Mercer Street. So Highland Mill, Mercer, Jefferson, all not looking good. And um, 
So with that, I urge you to be cautious. Now, um, that being said, okay, what's it like outside right now? Well, yeah, it's time for Lawrence County 45 weather, and here's what you're getting as far as <laughs> your first look-see. 32 in snow, and we got snow overnight. So, um, that being the case, how long will it last? Maybe your next question. Well, when you take a look at local radar, and local radar showing a very good picture of uh, what we have out over us and you can see it's pretty intense um, the 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 cell form and as I'm trying to uh, give you an idea now the wind speeds are variable um, so you're not getting a, a real uh, what do I want to say drive it, the drive is from the southwest okay if uh, that because you will have a southwest wind today at 9 to 16 miles an hour but the fact that the lake is not frozen isn't going to help you really too much as uh, you get moving so let's take a look at and we've got everything to show you here. Let's take a look at this national scene and um, here you go as uh, I kind of squared up for you. You can see clear all the way back. Uh, you, you're your area of clearing is uh, not so bad and um, well this will eventually come to a stop today as the day goes on it goes from 70 percent all the way down to 20. Now that only leaves one thing left to do take a look at your week and your weather and see what is in store. Well, after last night's low of 32, and um, you all know that the snow has fallen now, uh, so that being the case, the snow will continue on through the day, okay? Cloudy with an eye of 43. Well, going to take us a while to get out of this and as that precipitation continues it will become rain okay snow showers likely before noon then chance of rain showers between noon and 1 43 winds from the southwest 9 to 16 miles an hour take you guys to size 29 miles an hour 70% chance daytime accumulation less than a half inch. So, um, and you get to see the temperatures around. Boardman uh, didn't get updated. Unfortunately, maybe some of them didn't. Now, uh, so that gets you into the night, mostly cloudy and 33. Your <laughs> Monday. You're going to see some peaks of sun. Partly sunny, high near 50. That's not, and that is not a misprint, folks. Yeah, we're actually going to get up to 50 degrees on Monday. Don't go nuts, because the roller coaster continues. 
Monday night, cloudy, 43. Chance of showers, 50%. So we start to, Monday night, we start to build in with the rain. And Tuesday, showers, 52. Chance of rain, 80%. So Tuesday, on comes the rain. Tuesday night, showers likely, cloudy, 31. The chance of precip is 70%. So, Monday night you start transitioning to rain. Tuesday you get the rain. Wednesday, rain snow. Mostly cloudy, 35. Well, you know, it'll dip down because uh, it'll be 31 on Tuesday night. That'll generate the snow, and until we can beat it up to 35 you're going to get snow. Now, uh, Wednesday night, rain, snow, likely. Uh, mostly cloudy, 35, chance, 60%. And uh, that'll take you into Tuesday night, mostly cloudy, 31, chance of rain, snow, ice, 70%. Wednesday, Rain and snow showers, 60% chance of precip, mostly cloudy, 35. Wednesday night showers between 1 and 5 a.m., low of 28, chance of precip, 80%. Thursday showers, high of 42, chance of precipitation, 80%. Thursday night, here it comes again, cloudy, 28. 60% chance of the snow. And that balances it out to Friday. Now Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, cloudy, 33, 50% chance of precip. And uh, Friday night, it goes down to 24, 40% chance of precip, so the snow, gonna get pretty serious there. And then on Saturday, Rain, snow, mostly cloudy, 38. <coughs> so, um, folks, you're, you're, we're getting winter in small bites. Uh, and I don't really know how else to tell you. It. It's stopped snowing outside our window right now. Very fine flurry. Okay, and... Um, Well, it stopped snowing. We'll take it. Now, that was Lawrence County 45 weather. And um, stay tuned. We'll bring you those updates from time to time and get you posted on uh, what's exactly happening. So uh, be careful out there as you drive around. And uh, we're going to take this break and hear from these people Tuscany proud sponsor with BSB of the weather and also Tuscany and Vin they say so uh, with that we'll be right back Say in Newcastle is a premier winery located on Newcastle's southeast side on Wilson Avenue. Vinte Say open Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Features a variety of fine wines. 
and also fine food. Then they say for the very best. Well, folks, we are back, and uh, looks like you're going to clear up for your Monday, and then uh, <laughs> Tuesday on out, precip, so be ready for that. Up to 33 degrees, everything is basically melted, and uh, this wind chill of 27, I'm going to tell you, I, I, don't, I don't think so much as... I see no wind out there, very visible wind, so uh, that may be up at the airport up high, and uh, we'll just leave it go at that. Now, um, as we continue on, are you a bingo player? Well, Super Bingo, February 9th, $6,500 payout, doors open at 12 noon, bingo at 2, tickets $50.00. Uh, includes a master pack, one of each special extra packs available, Chinese auction, adults only, limited space, Union Township Fire Hall, call 724-333-6011. And uh, Chutin, you ain't rooting if you're not from Chutin. Chewton Volunteer Fire Department is going to have their fundraiser at Shenango Township Fire Hall. Yes, the fire department, ladies night, doors open at 5.30, there's a raff, raffle at 6.30, tickets will be sold in advance, $30 includes food and drinks, raffle prizes, and um, just a whole lot of fun, check that out. And uh, have a good time. Dog licenses are now available. Remember, first of the year, you have to get those. All dogs, three months and older, must be licensed January 1st. Each violator can be cited $300 per violation. So, uh, just to uh, get you up an animal on that. If you're going up this week to get your real ID, remember you need proof of identity, proof of social security number, two proofs of physical address, and uh, a proof of legal name changes. Yes, um, physical ID, very, very important. Uh, real ID, real, very, very important if you're going to get in Buildings, travel, whatever. So uh, that going on. And right now, remember out at St. James, they're having that breakfast brunch. And uh, that will continue till 1 o'clock. So uh, stop out and get some great food. Now, <coughs> we're going to take this break. We'll be right back with a whole bunch more and a wrap up on News Watch. GKG.com. This program brought to you by Cummings Landscaping and Design. Random Cummings Lower Operator. This program brought to you by Cummings. 
landscaping and design. Brandon Cummins, lower operator. This program sponsored by Lombardo's Apothecary, located at 1230 South Mill Street on the south side of Newcastle. Vision Station. Today's programming is brought to you by NCTV 45 and NC Radio 450, Newcastle's community television station. Well, folks, we're back, and that's going to do it for this edition of News Watch and. Uh, we came at you a little bit later this morning as uh, we were had a lot of things coming at you. Snow, uh, just what, and it's the big game. And um, I don't know who you're for, San Francisco or Kansas City. I'm pulling for a little Kansas City barbecue. But uh, hopefully it's a good game and I know the food will be great. And uh, make sure that you don't drink and drive stay alive now uh, make sure you tell a friend and have a friend tell a friend about NCTV 45 they'll be glad you did and when they say I don't watch a lot of TV you tell them that NCTV 45 is available anytime on your time yes a train that runs on your schedule why that's NCTV 45 right here in what I call the greatest castle in the world in the county of Lawrence so make sure you get that second cup of coffee and uh, have a super day and uh, hey just enjoy Monday will be here quick have a great day everybody and uh, we'll see you again real soon Got my ticket for the midnight plane, and it's not easy.